Hi, today it's going to be review for Estee Lauder Double Wear Light Foundation. I got this like one month ago and first I wanted to try it and test it, how this works on my skin tone, on my skin type and skin color and to say what I think about this foundation. I'm in shade intensity 01, which is 10, which is the lightest one. First of all, the shade is kind of half shade darker than my skin tone, and uh, but when I blend it with just a little bit in my neck, works perfectly. The package look like this. First, the package I really like it, especially because it's tube. It's very very easy to use. Just need to squeeze it and put it everywhere you want. If kind of it's empty, you can cut this out and take the rest of this. And it's very very practical and it's more easy to use. Um, then the package it's very slim, very very beautiful. It's in 30 milliliters, which is all the foundation is. I have it right now on my skin. First of all, to say I really like this foundation. I was gonna read on the website of Rasta Lauder because I wanted to see because in this website say so much things about this foundation and I want to kind of compare it to see the difference between their website and my opinion and to tell you what I'm thinking about this foundation. First of all, I have dry skin. I Before this one, like before two years ago, I tried Double Wear, the original um, foundation and that was super super cakey super super dry and uh, if i have dry spots uh, around my face that look like flaky uh, like a full coverage yes but very very kind of unnatural because it's super super dry but this foundation is i saw so much reviews and says it's kind of be good kind of double wear solution for everybody who have dry skin. First of all, I will gonna say 15 hours wear. Not 15 hours wear, but definitely 8 hours is going to be incredible for everybody who have dry skin. I work this like, I work like 8 to, to kind of 10 in the evening and I wear this like 12 hours maximum and still when before I take it out I have full coverage, full face makeup, my blush is not go, gone, I have just a little bit uh, shiny um, in my T-zone, especially 8 hours of wearing, but it's not that kind of greasy woo, greasy face, it's not, definitely it's kind of a natural glowy face especially on my forehead and my nose but definitely don't need to kind of blot away this or put any foundation powder or something like that to kind of conceal down the dewiness or the shininess it's kind of very good control oils like i said pretty pretty good for dry skin like at eight hours wearing it's kind of enough for see that you have perfect perfect foundation sheer to medium coverage definitely i don't uh, i'm disagree with this because for me i have so so bad dark circles i have flatness and some discoloration on my face but uh, if i don't put concealer this it's kind of enough coverage to me that means it's medium coverage maybe buildable it's definitely not full coverage like uh, you don't have any spots, any kind of shades on your skin. Definitely it's medium but buildable coverage. But sheer? Not. SPF 10. Yes, have the SPF 10. It's kind of not too much, but if you use um, uh, if you use a very, very good uh, moisturizer with higher SPF, it's going to be enough natural finish i must say this uh, have very very natural feel on the skin looks like you have not put any makeup especially if you put just a little bit to kind of even tone your face it's going to be perfect like you have whoa perfect skin but um, 
natural yes but it matte finish i saw so many reviews which say glowy or dewy finish definitely maybe it's for oily skin it's going to be dewy but with everybody who have dry skin definitely it's going to be a matte finish uh, when i apply this and kind of wait four or five seconds that it's set matte completely matte and don't move anywhere okay if I wanted to kind of uh, get more dewiness, I get like, or more SPF, I get Carotene 50 uh, with 50 factor uh, moisturizer. This is sunscreen, but I use it like moisturizer because it gives enough cover, uh, enough uh, sunscreen, but uh, of course just a little bit more oiliness on the skin and it's more easier to wear this one for dry skin. Next is uh, light as a long wear makeup. Yes, it's very very light, uh, light wear. Also, uh, especially on the skin, you don't feel like I. I don't feel like I have makeup on. Looks very very uh, light, don't cakey, don't don't gives me like feel. Oh my god, I have makeup on. I feel it. It's kind of you don't feel anything like makeup. Okay, uh, fresh, natural, yes, go sheer, leave skin to breathe all day, yes, control oil, definitely good, uh, resist smudging and won't melt, won't melt, uh, of course, <clears throat> sorry, I feel on my skin like I don't have it, and stay all day long on the place, and don't melt don't go anywhere which is very good for me especially for foundation most of the foundation which i put goes like everywhere um and smudging okay i get like uh, two days ago i kind of wear it very blouse very white and kind of i wanted to take it out but we forget to because i had done forget to forget that I have foundation on and kind of pull off and kind of go like this on my skin and I say, oh my god, I want, I need to wash this uh, blouse right now and I see the blouse and don't see anything and I say, what? This don't lift, don't smudge, don't. Oh, when I talk about uh, talk, uh, talk, uh, talk on my phone, don't see foundation on with every every single foundation which I use when I put on this on my cheeks I see ooh, foundation but with this definitely not definitely you will not be able to see anything which is very very good what I like in this foundation I like because it's full coverage especially I stay all day long in the place where I put it uh, blends pretty good i will i will show you right now what i use for applica applicate this foundation uh natural effect natural finish pretty good uh cheap pri price it's not good uh, this foundation in usa it's 35 dollars but right now right here where i live it's 61 dollar that is double price and that is so so expensive and I really don't know did I want to purchase again this piece because it's super super expensive if it's question for the formula for the works how this um, works to my skin definitely I will purchase again purchasing again but when it came to kind of price definitely not because it's so so expensive uh, uh what else okay i try so many ways to apply apply, apply, apply this on my face i try with um, the dual fiber brushes but try with the uh, with shorter uh bristles if it's too long this is not gonna go buffer into your skin because this foundation is so so thick formula and it's not going to blend very good but if it's short blends perfectly with this kind of uh, regular foundation brush, words were very good, but I like it before to put on my hand uh, just a little bit uh, primer. Work with that on the hand, kind of apply it the primer first, and with the same brush apply foundation works really really well. 
in uh, days when I want to kind of uh, light sheer medium coverage and more flawless looking skin more natural I use my fingers because this foundation melt in my fingers and more easy to apply because it's super super dry and thick formula but I like it the best with these brushes this is uh, 45 uh, mineral powder Sephora brush but uh, Sigma have also these brushes and it's very very easy to blend because it's more stiff brush and dense brush and kind of worked really good and you can buff uh, everywhere on your skin but most of the time I wear I apply with the fingers because it gives me the most incredible looking skin that was everything for this foundation definitely I love it but the price is super super expensive super super expensive uh, but the feeling on the skin the texture coverage a long lasting it's the perfect I really really recommend it, this uh, foundation especially for uh, who have dry skin and want that full coverage face and long lasting makeup thanks for watching and see you in the next tutorial or video thank you bye bye um, probably you can see that in this side I have foundation the skin tone looks more even more coverage this foundation is definitely not sheer coverage by the way as the louder double wear light and I use with this mineral powder brush by Sephora I really really love this brush kind of feel like everywhere